Thanks, Frankie. It's all about ingredients and every one of our recipes, the local ones at that. Our friend Marilyn Smith is here to share what's in season right now and a few easy recipes using local turkey. Yeah. Turkey like Taco Tuesday. Turkey right Taco Tuesday. Oh, I know. When you look at all the produce, you know, I think when people think, you know, use Ontario, eat Ontario mm -hmm. foods, yeah. they mostly think produce. But, like, look what, what is actually in season right now. I mean, we grow things like bok choy and gorgeous mushrooms and beets. I mean, all that stuff is in the market. So you can go to a farmer's market. You know it's from Ontario. But if you're going to the grocery store, make sure that you're looking for it. It says Ontario right on the label. And why do we yeah. love local? Obvious we, reasons. Fresh, seasonal, but you're supporting our you economy. Know what you're and our economy. And you totally do. I do totally do. But I think when people think local, they don't think about proteins. And so turkey, sure. Ontario turkey, I mean, we raise turkeys yeah. here. Mm -hmm. And you have to think of it not just for Thanksgiving. Yeah. And we use turkey a lot. So I've got a turkey taco Ooh. instead of, you know, so nice it's a, it, it really pretty. over the, Way over there. I can't go over there because I have that stupid cast like? on my foot. I know. Oh. I don't know how you're what do you want? They're, no, no, I'm just going to point at it. And then this recipe over here is a, a grilled turkey scallopini that's out of a homegrown. Mm. And the homegrown is the cookbook that I wrote with the Ontario Home Economics Association. And uh, Emily Richards, who's a home economist, that's her recipe. Beautiful. And I've got a recipe using uh, sweet potatoes and ground turkey for uh, like a, shepherd's, a pie? shepherd's pie. Okay, so Roger, you mash that up. That is so, old school. Oh, hey. That's I, oh, Roger. my goodness. You know, I am now. flashing back to my mom's kitchen right now. Okay, this this was my grandma's because I think it's really important to honor our, our, you know, our heritage and our, our relatives. And I love using all their old stuff. And we just so, had, I know you're obsessed with blues. I know, like I, I saw. Am. And she said it's the physical labor that goes yeah. into every day doing of things. Exactly. So like this. When you make your life too easy, you you know, it's not good for your health. That's right. So you're going to, that was buttermilk that I put in there. And then nice. this is really local parsley. It's in my, out of my garden. Natural with this. Okay, I made good. mashed potatoes last night. There actually. you go. Okay, so that's going to be the topping. And those are obviously pre-cooked. If you want to get the recipe, go to my my website, MarilynSmith.com. It's all there. What do you think of his technique? I think there? he's doing really well. Now stop it, because you don't want to mash the living daylights out of it. So gentle. I have some issues I'm working out right now, all right? <laughs> do you know cooking can do that? Isn't that hard for you? Okay. Now, in, in, my, in my frying pan, Thanks, in my Grandma. skillet, I have uh, Ontario garlic, Ontario uh, onions, and Ontario turkey. Okay. And then we're going to add Ontario carrots. Now, is this like the whole turkey breast? Is it turkey No, pie? it's ground turkey. Okay. Okay, now the turkey scallopini is a really thin cut of the turkey breast. Mm -hmm. And then uh, the the tacos were obviously ground as well. No, no, don't put the peas oh, in yet. Oh. Okay. So when you're doing this at home, do not put the peas in until you look at the recipe because they're going to go a little bit darker. Yeah. All right. Now these are button mushrooms, and those are uh, those are product of Canada too. Okay. And then we're going to add. Uh, can you put give me the flour? Indeed, Mary. So the the flour is uh, whole wheat. Now you can use white if you want, but I'm always trying to get in extra uh, fiber because I am the queen, the queen of, of fiber. fiber. And this actually the reason I like this dish it's an adaption that I, I got. I I sort of worked around this uh, a recipe that I had found, um, is that I loved how many vegetables were in it to add that extra fiber for you. Now we're going to add tomato paste and uh, chili sauce or uh, or ketchup or mm. barbecue sauce, whatever you want. Flavor Town. Flavor Town. Boom, boom, boom. This is so really this simple. Is a thickener, binder, all that stuff. Flavor enhancer, right, okay. o right on. And okay. then we're going to add uh, some red pepper flakes. Yum. Now you don't have to do that if you don't want it really, really hot, but you know, we want a bit of spice in it. Yeah, especially and, for and, kids. Sometimes. Yeah. They don't like this. This spicy. is family favorite. And if you do want to jazz it up, you could always put smoked paprika in. Oh, then I we're adding that. chicken broth or stock. Uh, this is broth, which you get in a tetra pack. And I like to use, uh, I really like the blue menu stuff because it's got no salt in it. And then we add the which peas. Is and then we add the peas. Well done. You're and a then natural. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I cooked in a no. little bit of canola oil already. Okay. okay, now, Roger, can you, I'll hold this and you, yep, you scoop push it, it in to scoop but it Mary, in there. But the carrots aren't going to cook on the skillet, right? So it's well, just we, to, we to saute this, together. We would have cooked this longer on the stove. Is um, that getting a little heavy? Yes, heavy. Uh, about, about 15 to, to make sure that the carrots are a little bit more cooked and it starts to thicken up in the pan. 15 on low? 15 on a like, mo, uh, low medium because you want it to like kind of bubble. With a lid and, or no lid? Uh, no, no lid. Kay. And then you just rough, rough uh, put on these and bake this in the oven. Okay, and that that's looks it. Delicious. That's and comfort food. It's comfort food, and it's coming in, and you know, kids going back to school. This is good. Thank and you, And this Roger. took how long to do? Uh, All in like 20 minutes. Yeah, right? yeah. Get over here. And, and don't, so, oh. What you guys don't see is <laughs> your it? incredible assistant. He's not coming. He's not coming. Life mate Scott. Uh, Scott, now you have to, Scott, you uh, can't leave me hanging. Scott, ladies oh. and gentlemen. There we go. Scott, because you, you know, when, without you. Yeah, like literally. How are you going to walk around with this? That is impressive. 
I, I did not wow. get it. Wow, anyway. that is impressive. <laughs> okay, so I did that, and she'll I be performing with the Rockettes in their Christmas special. <laughs> well, I was a trained dancer, okay, and I do yoga. <laughs> anyway, so, oh, oh, he's gone. Okay, great. Right. But honestly, how do, you, how do you do it? at Marilyn Smith, and every time we have to tell you, it's M-A-I-R-L-Y-N, yes. Marilyn. because people say that's, yes. there's Tammy at the window, so we're easily <laughs> here. Hi, Hi Tammy. Like, oh, there's somebody waving at you, a fan. Oh, it's it's Tammy Sutherland. She's here to get your autograph. She's always <laughs> wanted to meet you. <laughs> Oh, it's mad okay. this year. So our parting <laughs> remark is eat local. Yes, and eat, pick up yeah. the book Perfect. Homegrown. Oh, yeah. We and love what you do. All Ontario. All Ontario. Okay, we'll be good. back with more <laughs> BT on this Turkey Taco Tuesday. Turkey Taco Tuesday. Turkey Taco Tuesday. Turkey Taco Tuesday. Turkey Taco Tuesday.